Hello, my castaways, and welcome back to Deep Play. Last episode, we checked out the Bulwark by Gork. In this episode, we uh, we have something a little special this time. So I send most of my episodes to kind of an editor, um, more of a proofreader, proof watcher, I guess, um, to make sure I don't miss anything in the Deep Play maps. And after submitting the last episode, I got a text that said, the name of the next island is Castaway. So I thought that was pretty unique and uh, has a little bit of a special place in our community. So uh, yeah, I just thought it was worth mentioning. Anyways, let's get into it. All right, we are taking off here from uh, Guarama, Guar Guarma, Guamra. I I can I don't know why I struggle so much with remembering the name of this island for whatever reason. Um, anyways, we just came from right there, I believe. Yeah. And this is our next destination. So, uh, as I said in the intro, uh, I got a text in between last episode and recording this one saying that the island name, or the name of this island is Castaway, which obviously has a special place for uh, anyone in our community, since, uh, you know, you guys are my castaways. Uh, you know, it's, uh, oh, actually, oh shit, you know what? <laughs> um, this island's name is Castaway. I call you guys Castaways, not just because of, like, you know, the colloquialism of, like, being abandoned at sea, you're a castaway, but, like, the game of Stranded Deep is based off of the movie Castaway with Tom Hanks. If you've never seen Castaway and you've played Stranded Deep, holy shit, stop what you're doing right now and go watch Castaway. I mean, it's not like an, an insanely remarkable... Hmm. Not like an insanely remarkable movie. It's it's one of my favorites. I'm not gonna lie, but uh, yeah, I'm starting to think though that uh, this island is based off of the movie Castaway. So um, in the movie Castaway, Tom Hanks plays a FedEx delivery guy who gets stranded on a uh, an island out in the middle of the Pacific after his plane uh, goes down mid-flight on a tiny little island called. Uh, my memory serves, I want to say it's Mono Oriki, Mono Rock, Mono Riki, Mono Oriki, something like that. Um, and it's this like itty bitty tiny little island with a bunch of cliffs and stuff. And uh, basically, it's just a story of how he survives there until he, uh, well, either gets rescued or doesn't. If you haven't seen it, I'm not going to be the spoiler for it. You should definitely watch Castaway. Anyways, um, so this is. The island Castaway, and uh, there's a pretty, like, I don't want to say titular because that's not really the word, um, but there's this one scene in it where he tries to hang himself from a tree, and <laughs> I'll be damned if this does not look like the tree. It's a little big for the movie, but uh, yeah, I'm starting to think this is going to be the Castaway Island, which is awesome because I, I, you know, for the longest time I wanted to make an island that was based off of that movie, but, uh, I don't know, I just never did, so, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's take this puppy down and, uh, see what the hell's going on here on, uh, Castaway, I'm gonna guess it's Mono Riki. all right, <laughs> let's go check out this little, tiny little bit out here, I don't think there's anything out here, but, uh, yeah, 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 there's no way. There's no way this island is not based off of that movie Castaway. Um, I'm not saying that because of, like, you know, anything I'm seeing right now, but, like, I just can't believe it now that I'm thinking about it. Like, it's got to be that. So uh, let's make sure we watch this episode through that lens. Um, we're Tom Hanks. See? I got to watch. Yeah, I think in the movie... Alright, well, okay, okay. So, there should be a cave right around here. If this is like the movie. Um, I've seen it just an ungodly amount of times. Yeah, and here's a little survivor shelter. So, like, I think this is supposed to be, like, you know, his little shelter. Um, 
Too bad you can't make one out of it. Honestly, there should be a survivor shelter that's made out of a life raft. You know, like the tattered remnants of a life raft. Because that's like what it is in the movie. And it makes so much sense, too. Because, like, you would def. I mean, like, uh, I look over here like I'm looking at my life raft that I came in on. But I came in on a helicopter. Um, if you had a life raft, you would totally set that up as a shelter. You know, if you're stranded on some desert island. So, you know, and the fact that this game is based off of that movie... Uh, I don't know, call me crazy, I just think that there should probably be a survivor shelter that's based off of a life raft. Whatever. Let's check out this island. <laughs> Alright, so most of this is like some hilly area. Oh. Okay. I don't think this was in the movie. Hmm, alright, yeah, we got this shit. Nice little cave area. I mean, it's, it's unique in the sense that you don't usually see people just, like, build, like, a flat surface there and then build an area underneath it, I guess. We'll keep going around from out here. Ah. Oh, come on. Uh. Uh. Oh, eh, you're not going to be able to follow me in a second anyways. <laughs> You know, I'm not expecting there to be any underwater portions of this. Um, I don't think there are any underwater portions of that movie, but uh, it might behoove us to kind of check that, I guess. There aren't sharks and castaways. Bullshit. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on. Wrong way. God damn it. Alright. Well, I don't think we'll be exploring that at all. Don't think there's anything over here. This does seem like a prime spot for like a underwater cave or something though. No? Yeah, uh, let's um let's grab that. Some sort of cave area. Much too open for my liking. This would be a really cool area to put like a um, platform across the water in. Well, we got this giant tanker over here, but that was not a part of the movie. Um, we aren't going to have enough time, though, right now to actually go check it out, so I will go sleep and come back. Um, let's see what the hell this is. I feel like that's... Obviously, it's part of a shipwreck, but... It looks weird, does it not? Oh, it's one of these. Okay, we're not going to... Oh, God, we're totally going to get bitten, aren't we? Oh, 
<laughs> All right, it is super fucking dark. Oh, right, we got a flare gun. Hot damn. All right. Oh, hey. Nice. Nice. We found Tom Hanks's package. Hell yeah. <laughs> Nothing in there. Alright, um, I gotta get to an area with trees, though. So, um, yeah, I'll, I'll walk around, make a bed up and all that stuff, and then I'll see you guys in the morning. See you in a few. Alright, six in the morning, just in time. I'll just leave that crap there. Doesn't really matter. Take all this stuff. All right, I guess we'll head off this way. We kind of went up the middle area um, yesterday, and now we're gonna head around this side, I think. I'm gonna try and get some high ground. Hey, this looks like a path. Well, damn it, this isn't a path, all right. <laughs> Seems like we stumbled upon something here. I, uh, I'm hoping it's not just like a pathway through the actual rocks. I'm hoping this leads up to the tree. It does seem like we are gaining height, so that's nice. Yeah, I think this is the path of the tree. Oh, damn. Where the hell does that go? I want to go down there, but uh, I'm not sure exactly what it is. Well, I'll be damned if we don't try something out, right? Ah, that's what this is for. Okay. Ah, oh, Christ, we gotta walk around this whole thing. Alright, be right back. Alright, I think this is a different path. You fucker. Oh my god, the snake. Dude. There we go. What? There's another snake? Oh, fuck you. Alright, well, we're just getting out of here. Seems abnormally tall. All right, guess we're not getting out that way. I want to make it up to that tree area. Although I do really enjoy these cliff caves. This is nice. Everything's so tight together. Whoa. 
Whoa, hey. I don't know if there is another way into here. What the fuck? Oh, okay, there's the tree. All right. I was going to say, where the hell is this tree? I feel like I've been looking around for it for quite a while now. Look, I'm, I'm not going to be a stickler about this, obviously. Um, well, I say obviously, you have no idea what I'm talking about. I looked into making this island. This isn't anything like this island, just for the record. Like, I looked up topographical maps and stuff. That's the reason I know the name Monoariki. Mono um, I was looking at making this exact island, and while um, that seems... Okay, it's on a it's on a it's on a seafort bridge. Well, wow, wow, this is uh, incredible, and somebody put a whole lot of time into it. Uh, Mono Ariki is a very small island. It is not does not have very large cliffs like this, and uh, I don't know. I just uh, I kind of wish somebody had made it like true to form. I can't really bitch. I didn't actually end up making the island myself, anyways. So like you know whatever it is, that's what it is. <clears throat> but yeah, I kind of, I, I don't know, I just, I, I, when I was starting to think that this may be Castaway, I was hoping it'd be like, you know, this giant spear, which is very prominent feature on Mono Uriki, and then like, kind of a mountain where the caves are and stuff, but, uh, I don't think that's the case. There is one, like, really distinct cave that's supposed to like wind through the mountains at some point and uh, I feel like we haven't quite found it duct tape flare gun wooden stick honestly if you wanted somebody to really get the picture that somebody was trying to hang themselves up here you'd put a lashing in a chair um that sounds oddly insensitive um that's not how I mean that at all let's hit this shark with a spear oh I missed Anyways, um, all of everything that I just set aside, wow, isn't this island cool? <laughs> um, I, yeah, can't make it down there. All right, let's, uh, eat this piece of fruit. Eat this piece of fruit. All right, I'm thinking we probably missed something somewhere along the way. Um, let's check out this little platformish area right here is this where we were with the boar maybe not quite Yeah, I'm thinking this is supposed to be the path. But I really want to find, like, the, the cave from that movie. Alright, so... The cave entrance should be over here somewhere. If it's, if it's following the Castaway movie, there should be some sort of cave entrance, like, right over here. And it'll be up on these rocks. Alright, so this is supposed to be that cave. However, um, you know, not to... Uh, I always... I feel like I always end up saying something that's like disparaging against like the person uh, who makes the islands. This is nowhere near 
what the cave system was like in that movie. Um, I obviously it's a it's a really daunting task for someone to like recreate that, but really this thing should have been going like where my head is right now. That's where the floor should be right about now, going up and then curling around kind of this this direction and leading out to a hole on the upper side of this cliff that looks out over the ocean. Um, I'm. <laughs> You know, this is so much easier to say than it is to actually do. So, uh, you know, as as uncritical as I can sound of the person who made this island, uh, you've done an, an absolutely remarkable job of like replicating it. I just uh, I notice I notice things, I guess. But yeah, this should definitely curve up and around up to here, and then have another hole at the top of those caves. Um, I hope I'm not missing something. Give me that. I'm Tom Hanks. I gotta do, go deliver this, all right? <laughs> but yeah, I don't think that's uh, I don't think this is exactly movie accurate. That's okay. Yeah, so I'm thinking you would find like a, a cave mouth like right here. Actually, that is kind of suspect, isn't it? Is there a cave mouth up there? Ah. Uh, no way I can climb that. Maybe it's up here a little bit. There's like plants in here. It's so weird. Maybe this is what it's supposed to be. Ah, yes, and we're back here. God damn. No, no, I don't want in there. All right, I think we're gonna try and see if there's some sort of cliff area like I was talking about, and if that's not the case, then uh, we'll just do kind of a fly around, see if we missed anything, and that'll be the episode. Seems like a good area to get up right here. Okay, so this is the path that goes around. I want to take this and see if there's any little cavelets along here. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, is it another storm? What are we like? 12 for 12? It's gotta be something ridiculous. We have had so many fucking storms. Oh, wait, no, no, no. This is like the top again. And there's the hole down in the water. Alright, but this is that area that I was talking about that, like, should, in theory, be like the door that goes out up here, but I don't see anything like that. I might just barely be able to get up there.
Hell, oh, I was like, oh yeah, hell yeah, we made it. No, I didn't even, I <laughs> didn't even need to climb the tree. God, I can't talk. Yeah, I just don't think there's uh, another internal cave structure, unfortunately. Oh, God. No, no, no. There we go. Yeah, I think that's going to about do it, folks. I just don't see anything else. Um, unless there's some hidden pathway here. Hold on now. Hey, we might have actually found something. Oh, yeah, we found a bare face of a rock. Great. Hey, oh no, we actually did find something now. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, we are back here. Uh, my recording cut out randomly, uh, so I stopped it, and by the time I was able to figure out what was going on with it, it was already nighttime. So, uh, yeah, we're back here the next day, and uh, let's continue on. I see the snake in there. Not today, thank God. All right, um, rations, awesome. Lantern, more rations, and a rock. Wow, that was so worth it. Oh man, I'm really glad that I took the extra like 20 minutes to come back and do this after uh, my recording cut off. Uh, so I think this was supposed to be kind of the cave where he was staying. I doubt there's anything behind this, but hey, we'll find out. What do you know? It's another big pile of rocks. Can we can we actually see out here? Oh no. Yeah. So like in the movie, you know, there'd be like a a little area in a tiny cave, just like this, just like this. Um, it would have been attached to more caves, and there'd be a little hole right here where you could see the shadow come through on the wall where he used uh, the the light playing on that shadow to make a calendar essentially. But um. Yeah, not exactly as accurate as the movie. Anyways, that all being said, uh, I think we've checked out just about everything here. I'll do a little scour, make sure we didn't miss anything, like, you know, important. Um, I say that. There's that thing over there, maybe. But anyways, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys again for another episode of Deep Play. Drop a like and subscribe, please. But, you know, we'll see you again. So, uh, yeah. That's it. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye.